so hey guys welcome to the hamster channel and in today's video i've been showing you guys how to mine chia and is it profitable so i will be going into some ideas and some many things you need to know about before we're, i'm gonna show you how to do it so so chia mining chia is a cryptocurrency network for global financial system as farmers we will provide our computer storage and time to maintain the, the system working <laughs> and in today's tutorial i will be showing you how to set up chia farming in your computer of course all they are counting on your equipment performance for chia you need to consider CPU, memory, storage for temporary folder, and storage for final folder. I will suggest to have a faster CPU and a big size of memory. For temporary files, I would suggest to use SSD because faster SSD can improve your primary process. For final folder, I will suggest to use HDD because they are cheaper and larger capacity. The proof of space and time. So proof of space kind of means the land size and like how big it is. The bigger is better. And the proof of time is how long you will be spending to farm a land or to harvest a land. So basically it means that how long will you be able to harvest this full land. So the plot in Q versus plot in parallel. So plot in queue means you line up, basically means like you finish the first line that move to the next line. For example, like this, you line up like this. So you basically just line up like this. And then when you finish uh, harvesting a line, you just, you kind of go and just so on. Plot in parallel means that the first one is finished half, like some portion. And then at the same time, you're going to start to harvest or farm another land and so on, for example. <laughs> so for example, like this, you just farm like kind of like half, you finish half, and then you kind of start farming the ups like kind of like this. And then you kind of just keep going and just like so on, stuff like that. And as a demo, I will be showing you how to monitor your farming process with Tag Manager. <laughs> based on your CPU and memory and storage to adjust delay time for utilization. So my computer setting experiment. So my computer setting experiment. So basically this is my computer and I'm just going to give you the information for mine first and let's start. So first we're going to Google Chia and then as you can see, um, so we're going to press Windows. We're going to install it first. We're going to install the software. So after install, so we're going to press Chia back blockchain Windows. And we're going to press create a new private key. So we're basically signing into account. So this is your full knot. So this is all your information and this is your wallet your balance and so this is your plot i will be showing you in you guys later this is the farm that uh, the keys are just your like kind of like your information signing and okay we're gonna go to plot and uh, we're gonna switch the plot size to the 101 about 101 gigabyte and then choose the number of plot is one and then we're going to press add plot to queue and then we're not really going to change the information here we're going to scroll down we're going to press browse we're going to select the temporary director and then the, we're going to and that you can select a second one if you want and then we're going to select the final directory we're going to browse and you can just, and we're going to press create plot and then as you can see here that's your status it is plotting right now it's starting it's at one percent and that's your cute name it's default and we're going to now go to tax manager so we're going to press Control plus alt plus delete And as you can, we're going to click that child. So that's your CPU right now. 
it's about um, it's a hundred percent, about ninety something percent, actually about eighty something percent plus. And your memory, your disk, and network, and you know, yeah. Right now, it's really high, very high, and. So we're gonna press view log, and this is the CPU activity over, and it's over 50%, and the speed is 3.47 gigahertz, as you can see there. And your utilization is 100%, and the speed is 3.47 gigahertz. And that's your time. So it's been a long time. Um, so the final file size is a hundred and one point, about a hundred gigabyte, and the total time is three thirty one thousand two hundred seventy eight seconds, which equals to eight hours and forty minutes. And the file saved location is there. So that's the size of it and file name and other stuff. So it takes 8 hours and 40 minutes for one plot on my computer, as you can see there. So it is not profit profitable. So now I'm going to show you how to farm. So we're going to press farm, we're going to press add a plot. And then we're going to press plot in parallel. And then the RAM is 3370. And then number of threads 2. And then number of buckets 128. And the queue name is default. So plot in parallel. So delay before next plot starts. So um, we're gonna choose two minutes just for an experiment. So this is just like an example for you guys. So I'm, I'm gonna ch type in two minutes. So yeah. So we're gonna press create plot and now it's plotting right now. So as you can see, the CPU activity is over 50% too, and the speed is 3.47 gigahertz. And the disk is uh, SSD is over 70%. And as you can see that it's cooled. And the second one is going, it's plotting now. The disk is as the SSD over a hundred percent, and it's over capacity, so it's not profitable. So in summary, for one plot, this computer spends about eight hours and forty minutes. And based on the results, I need to increase the memory size to 32 gigabytes and have better CPU. For temporary folder, the SSD needs to upgrade to NVMe SSD, so the speed is four times faster than my SSD right now. And of course, for storage, I need more space, such as 32 TB. I guess my I guess after upgrade, one plot can short to less than six hours. And that's all. The end. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to subscribe and like. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.